Hi, how are you? I am Roger, and in this video, I talk about respect. Respect and disrespect. And uh, my wife and I were recently talking, and as we as we observe and witness um, res disrespect that uh, people have for each other these days. And actually, it's uh, written in, um, I'll give you a verse, uh, 1 John 2.18. 1 John 2.18. And that verse deals with the Antichrist. Now, how it relates to disrespect is, uh, disrespect is basically the, uh, um, it's disrespecting uh, human life. Um, it's uh, respect, respectful behavior promotes life and preserves life. Um, disrespect is very destructive. Mocking, insulting, and not only in words, but also in behavior, cutting in line, uh, uh, these are the days in which uh, people will be lovers of themselves, and because of that, they will disrespect each other. And it's it's uh, love for self and not caring for others, not looking out, out for others. And uh, so, uh, respectful behavior promotes and preserves life. Uh, disrespectful behavior, um, it uh, it's very. Um, uh, it's actually it's anti-Christian. Um, as a uh, as a follower of Christ, we are called to the first command is to love each other. Well, to love each other that can be defined as respecting each other, no matter you know res respect. You're a human being, whether you, whether I agree with you or not, I respect you, and it must you know it needs to be mutual. Uh, disrespect is. Uh, it's a uh, very it's anti behavior. It's uh, respect. Um, if we uh, uh, we need to respect each other, we need to respect each other as human beings. Uh, God calls us to do that, and it helps. Uh, it just builds respect. Builds and respect must be earned. Um, and I do have you know. I just thought of something. Uh, respect is also taught. R respect is taught. Respect used to be taught in the home. Now, fit, now we get respect from faith, okay? As, as when God commands us to love one another, that's what respect means: is to love one, to respect one another, okay? And from faith, now if we, uh, if a family is faith-based versus religion, religion doesn't teach this; only faith teaches this. So, um, I came from religion, but uh, I uh, I chose faith in my 30s, in my early 30s, I chose faith, uh, faith. I chose to live, uh, to accept Jesus Christ and live by his principles. And so I accepted that. And so, and plus my parents were, um, they were uh, parents who taught respect. Okay. So maybe there are homes that don't talk, teach respect or there are some broken homes where one parent is trying to teach respect, but they can't do it alone. So, uh, I have this to say to you. If you come from a background where there was no respect, there is one, there's one way you can learn respect and, and earn it. And that is by accepting Jesus as your savior and allowing him to come into your life, to come into your heart and teach you to respect others. See, when man fails at something, okay, man will fail. Mankind, you know, men, woman, mankind fails. Uh, everyone fails, uh, you know, at some point. But God never fails. So if you are, uh, if you accept that, hey, you know, uh, I think I do have some disrespectful be uh, behavior about me. Okay. Well, once you acknowledge that you have a problem, come to come to your Lord, come to your Lord and Savior, and just confess that and just say, Lord, uh, you know, uh, turn me into a, uh, change my heart and turn me into a person of respect. A respecter of other human beings of other people and uh and only the lord can do that because in these days in these days uh homes are are failing to teach it because homes are being broken um uh you know uh, people are falling away from faith families are falling away from faith and that's where we get respect through faith through the through the life of jesus who respected jesus was disrespected on the cross <laughs> he was disrespected by all of us on the cross, but he forgives us. That's why he hung on the cross, but we have to uh, receive that forgiveness. So if you admit that you've been, you know, disrespectful towards each, towards people in your life, 
just come to come to the Lord uh, and, uh, so, you know, Lord, I'm sorry. Help me to respect people. And uh, and so, oh, uh, also below this video, below this video, I have uh, placed a prayer of salvation. It's a very simple prayer you can pray. Uh, if you haven't received Christ, you can pray it. Um, if you uh, and that includes once you pray pray the prayer of salvation, that also includes um, uh, you're asking the Lord to come into your life, and He'll help you with uh, respecting, with uh, earning respect. If you weren't taught respect in the home or anywhere else in your life, uh, the Lord will teach you, and just allow Him to teach you. He'll teach you lovingly and gently. Also below that is a below that is um, a prayer for uh, for those you can pray for those who are disrespecting you or who you see who are disrespectful, and you can pray for that person. You can pray for anyone you want you desire. That's what prayer is for. And so uh, so once again, I just wanted to say that respectful behavior promotes life and preserves life. Okay, that's what we're called to do. Uh, disrespectful behavior is very destructive. Um, when someone's disrespected, and it can lead to, uh, let's, I'm just going to put it right on the line there. When someone's disrespected, they can feel so low about themselves that no one's respecting me. It can lead to a person taking their life. Okay. Let's put it where it is. All right. Disrespect is very harmful behavior. The, the Bible says it. it's very harmful behavior. And it's, and if there's anyone out there calling themselves a Christian, a Christian, and they're disrespecting then you're you're an anti-christian okay and you and you know okay we're and that's um leading towards anti-christ um you're an anti-christian so don't be an anti-christian accept jesus today uh ask him for help in in teaching you how to respect people and uh and i just i hope you were blessed with this message if you found this message uh um helpful please share it please share it respect needs to be um uh, re share this video of respect and I didn't edit it. Um, this is just right off the cuff and this is real This is me being real. This was on my heart this morning because there's so much disrespect and that's a that's a choice to be selfish to hey I'm looking out for me number one. No, we had no the Lord calls us to look out for each other And so respectful behavior promotes and preserves life Disrespectful behavior is toxic and harmful. So choose respect and uh and reach out to the lord for to help you grow closer to him and, and to respect all right thank you for watching and please share this if you found it helpful and i uh, wish you well and uh and god bless you